Looks like we've got a trained killer on the loose. Meet the assassin bug, known for its stealth hunting practices and gruesome methods of attack. They have the power to liquefy their victims' guts and slurp them up like a slushy. These bugs are also masters of disguise. They will hide in foliage and stick their legs out, waiting for a tasty snack to saunter by. Their legs are coated in a sticky goo that traps their meal. And then it's venom time. See that pointy thing nestled underneath the thorax? Well, I guess it's hard to miss. That's the proboscis, the assassin bug's murder weapon of choice. When at rest, the proboscis stays folded inward toward its body. But when in attack mode, the proboscis extends and is able to quickly neutralize any prey. They use it to inject their meal with enzymes that dissolve its insides, turning them into an easy-to-digest liquid. Then the proboscis is used like a straw to suck up the newly liquefied bug. That's one smoothie I think I'll skip. This is called extraoral digestion. It's the ability to break down food before actually ingesting it. It would be like if you could use your spit to fast forward the digestion of a donut without consuming it first. But who wants to eat sweets through a straw? However, in the world of insects, this type of fancy feasting is not uncommon. And out of the more than 7,000 different types of assassin bugs, most of them eat this way. One exception is the kissing bug. They are less romantic than the name suggests. The kissing bug is classified as an ectoparasite. They live on the skin of their host, getting sustenance through blood sucking like a leech. But that's not even the worst part. Their parasitic poop can carry Chagas disease. When infected, a person can suffer from diarrhea, fever, and in severe cases, heart problems. Sounds like the kiss of death to me. But don't fret, the kissing bug is the exception to the rule. Most assassin bugs are completely harmless to humans. And if you do get bitten, or should I say stabbed, chances are you'll experience minimal pain and localized swelling, no sweat. It's not like they could turn your insides into soup. That would be horrific. From a human perspective, these insects can actually be a huge help, especially if you're a farmer or gardener. They feed on pests such as millipedes and ants. Because of their unique, albeit violent, digestion method, assassin bugs can eat prey twice their size. So assassin bugs are doing your bidding. Maybe they deserve a raise. They've also been around since the Jurassic period. Talk about ancient. The success of the species boils down to their wide distribution. Assassin bugs can be found in every terrestrial ecosystem on Earth, from deserts to forests. You name a bioregion and an assassin bug will be just around the corner. North America alone is home to 159 different species. From an evolutionary standpoint, their ruthless hunting strategy has paid off. They expend minimal energy while on the prowl and can sometimes score big depending on what bug comes along. Most assassin bugs are only a threat in the insect world, but remember that kissing bug? You can find the dirty details on their dangers to people in our video all about them. Paralyzing their dinner with their pointy proboscis and turning their prey's insides into mush is what assassin bugs do. And that's what makes them crazy creatures.